Hey everyone, Sean Tierney here with TheAutomationBlog.com and this is part two of my nine part series covering what I consider as the best new products from Automation Fear 2017, specifically the best new PLC and HMI products they've shown. Now, I didn't actually go to the fair this year, I went last year, so what I'm doing is I'm getting all the information from their product guide that uh, they released when the uh, Automation Fair was held. And you can actually look at that product guide yourself and pick out your own favorite products over at the uh, link at the bottom of the screen right now. That'll take you right there. But with that said, let's take a look at my second product pick of Automation Fair 2017. And these are in order of when they're going to be released. So not necessarily my second favorite, but uh, this is a good one. It's uh, Studio 5000 apparently is getting a refresh and I'm assuming this is going to be version 31. I went online earlier this week and uh, did not see a new version available. So I'm um, not sure exactly when this is coming out, but it's said to be coming out this month, December 2017. And what they're going to do here is they're going to um, really update the software. They're trying to make it, uh, you know, just more user friendly, more efficient to use. Um, easier to use, optimize your programming time is one of the phrases they use. And, um, you know, don't know, don't know what that means until we see it, but it sounds good, right? And uh, along with the changes to Logic Designer, they're also going to be making changes to View Designer. And with View Designer, they're saying they've built in data logging and trending, which they've really needed because. To be honest with you, the Panel View 5000 is the only Panel View I know of, or HMI, really, may, uh, you know, major HMI in the market, that didn't have built-in data logging and trending. So to be able to add that is great. But the other feature they're adding, which I'm excited about, is emulation. So you can emulate your HMI right on your computer. Now, you know, Factory Talk View has had that forever, right? And uh, even RS View back in the mid-90s had that. So... This coming into the product, I think, will make a lot of people more comfortable with the product. So that said, Studio 5000 Architect gets some upgrades, as well as the Application Code Manager. But uh, I think what most people will use is Logic Designer, you know, to create their lot of logic in function blocks and structured text. And um, they just said they've done a lot of optimizing and cleaning up of the programming languages. So... Really, there's nothing more about that, but it's kind of exciting. I can't wait to try both Logic Designer and View Designer um, when the latest release comes out. But um, what do you think? Now, if you have thoughts on this, head over to theautomationblog.com. There's a companion article to this video, which has a poll in it. And so you can take a poll and uh, let us know your thoughts about, uh, you know, are you excited about this redesign or not? And uh, there's also a link there if you want to share your comments and thoughts. You can do that as well. Now, if you know anybody who would like to learn how to use Control Logics in Studio 5000, please uh, uh, send them a link to my website, theautomationschool.com, where I have several courses, uh, one specifically on Control Logics in Studio 5000 and RS Logics 5000. And with that, that's it. Until next time, peace.